Welcome hey back guys. to Weebs Gamer, the uh, podcast wait, where we talk about everything the? to do with Weebs Gamers and podcasts, <laughs> and anything to do with anime, video games, or anything else we want to talk about. <laughs> Alan, take it away. Love you, sir. I just know I practice every week for 50 in two weeks to do that, so I needed to say that. So continue. Why, Thank why you. Not, I love why you. Not? You're great. Mwah. Kisses. <laughs> Bro, Bye. the guy preps me. He's like, yo, Alan, you're going to take care of the intro and I'm going to, you know, do a little break. And the guy just does the intro. Yeah. What the f anyway, that's, that's well, yeah, guys, as Andre just said, thank you guys for coming back for week 52. We got two more weeks till we've done a full year of podcast. Oh, so thank shit. you for sticking around. Um, we appreciate the love and, and, uh, Wait, and all the weeks? comments and likes. Yeah, two weeks because it's going to be 54. 52 weeks in the year, but This is one year? Yeah, I think so. I appreciate Wait. it, yeah. No, nah, you're, 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 yeah, okay. Sean's out, weeks in Sean, a year. <laughs> Sean, Sean's out here, like, uh, how many, how many weeks in a year? I thought there were 54 weeks in a year. It's 52! Happy <laughs> one year you. anniversary, everyone. Happy one year anniversary. Andre, did you hear that? Please tell me you heard that. No, I uh, think you he heard that. Hear yo, that. yo, Andre. I didn't did hear you what know, you said. What you did said? you know there's you 52 <laughs> weeks in a year? Yeah. So happy anniversary, man! This is our yeah. one year. Yeah. This is our one year. <laughs> oh, I didn't even take that in. Alan I was, was hyping up. Alan you know? was hyping up that two weeks from now would be one year because there's 54 weeks in a year, apparently, according to Alan. <laughs> I didn't know. Okay. Anyway, well, thank you guys for sticking around. Uh, we appreciate all the support. It's been a year of growth and learning, mm -hmm. and and we we've done that. A whole and, lot of uh, learning. A whole lot of learning, and we're still learning. Uh, but Lots we're gonna ramp growing. it up a little bit this year, and uh, we're. Sean's going to start doing stuff, but yeah. Uh, just I want to start it. off by saying... Hey, shut up. Just want to start by saying, today I feel fantastic. It was leg day. I can't... Mm. I feel my booty cheeks. Sean, Every day is leg day for Ellen. Um, day. I just ate a shitload of Osmos chicken on the rocks. I'm going to be shit shitting a lot in the toilet later. <laughs> if you know, good. you know. That sounds, you know, so, you know. Good. That sounds that so good. That sounds so <laughs> good. <laughs> it was I'll take good. the diarrhea, bro. I'll take the diarrhea. <laughs> And when you're oh trying to sell God. a house, completely destroying your toilet usually isn't a, <laughs> a, good, a good way to do, do it. No, <laughs> shout out you have to learn. Yo. You only shit. I mean, shout out. How, oh, many, how long have we been in this? How long would did we say I we're not supposed to swear for? Shit, it's not Remember, swear. Alan, no, when you said you were going to cut out all the swearing and then you didn't? Remember that? I cut and out the big first minute. I did it good. He did, did it good. Yeah, it? I did. Sure good. did. Anyways, I did. Anywho, oh, I'm trying to tell a story. Okay. Only shit on company time. Never. Yeah, that's a good point. Home, at least get paid to only shit. Only at work. Yeah, you're right. Exactly. You're right. Yeah, Except but then Andre goes and pisses in, uh, during podcast time. So yeah. Company time, Andre. homie. I guess so. That's true. <laughs> that is true. Company time. Yeah, that, that, is true. that wouldn't work at my work because there's like one stall and everyone can hear what you're doing in there. So it's not so a fun true, time. True. So. So it's just like I feel like that works better because if you're in there for half an hour, uh -huh. if they can hear it the whole time, then you're gonna be like, "Hey, you can't, you can't argue, you can't say yeah, I was wasting time in there because you heard me." Yeah. <laughs> really you heard, heard it. it. That's true. That's you know true. Mean? Yeah. Okay. Uh, how are you, Andre? Uh, <laughs> we didn't ask did Andre guys, how did you guys doing? already. Did you guys already say how you guys were doing? Yeah. Yeah, yeah. we're we're doing. Right. Was it was Alan um, with the leg day, me with the shitting, and then you. <laughs> oh, my turn. Okay, so, um, I don't know. I've been doing okay. Yeah. Been doing pretty much one thing, working, um, and doing something else. And something else. I went outside. We'll get yeah, into it. Else? Don't worry. Okay. Don't worry. Uh, we'll okay. get into it. And then I went outside today. Actually, let's start the story from yesterday. Sean is like, hey, we got to move the pod. And I'm like, yo, what is happening? Sean always has got to move the pod. He always got to do it on different days. So, disclaimer, guys. This is, we're recording, even though this is live right now, mm -hmm. we're recording it earlier than we usually do. Um, so, so no platinum today. <laughs> yeah, no yeah, platinum, no in platinum. because it is not currently out, even though we're recording live on Friday, that even mm -hmm. though it came out yesterday, it's currently not out today. Yeah, Anyways. Not. <laughs> Anyways. Yo, question, question, um, question. Hold on, what? hold on. What? Like, you know how you can wear a watch, right? Watch. Do you, do you guys ever wear like two watches for fun? Oh my god, why would you have two Yo, watches? Yo, Samsung and Apple at the same time, bro. This guy's okay, crazy. Okay, keep on going, keep on going. <laughs> this guy's crazy. Yeah. Why aren't you a tech YouTuber, bro? Start, uh, uh, start writing nah, reviews, that, homie. Yo, what yo, are you why? doing, bro? Mar 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 Marquise Brownie or whatever his name is, that guy's too good, bro. That guy, so that but guy there's is, more. There's more yeah, than just yeah, him. But, dude, I'm not trying to compete against like a god. Yeah, that I'm just telling you, he's the one who convinced me to buy an iPhone. IPhone. That's what I'm, I'm saying, bro. The guy's like, know. the guy literally starts off with guys. The iPhone 13 is kind of shit, and then by the end of it, I'm buying an iPhone 13 because 
It's actually a pretty yeah, this good guy phone. Breaks it down. So Yo, those little, phone. those like intro so shots. I'm like, the way this guy drops a phone and like spins the camera and it goes like, <laughs> bling. I'm like, yeah. yo, how did you even take that freaking <laughs> shot? That's yeah. like movie quality for a freaking. <laughs> yo, commercials aren't even shot that well, bro. This I'm guy's crazy, you, bro. That's and did you see this guy playing freaking Ultimate Frisbee, bro? This guy's an athletic menace. Bro. He's a menace. He's crazy. Athletic marvel, bro. This guy's hopping freaking. This guy has better verticals than half the <laughs> NBA, bro. Jack of all trades, this guy apparently. Uh, he yeah. is very so, very much so. Yeah, bro. Yeah, but, bro. Anyways, but that bro. being said, yeah. Andre has been playing some video games. Wait, I didn't <laughs> tell telling you about my, how I am. Yeah, I just freaking said, Fuck take you, a no break. Yeah, we're telling the story. Okay, story. I was telling the story. Yeah. So Sean, a couple days ago, said we gotta move the pod, yeah. and I was like, and all I did was do an upside down smiley face. He did. And then Alan bullied me like he usually does he because did. listen. But I do. I never complained about it happening. I just wanted to be like, hey, man. You know, actually, no, there was yeah, nothing. Want, there was actually yeah, no want... reason for me to do that. Because changes <laughs> the podcast affected my life in zero ways at all. Zero. So, like, it's I could have done it, it just fine. Life, but man. I just wanted it to make sure everyone knew that I was aware that, hey, this isn't what we normally do, but we're doing it this week again for the second hey, week in a row. That's true. So I needed to just convey that message. I had a good reason okay? to no, no. I had a good the reason. real reason Andre did upside down, uh, like you know, upside down smiley face, frowny face. Oh wait, what? it was legit an upside down, upside down face. smiley face. Yeah. Yeah. Oh right. So the reason why I did that is because no platinum, and everyone loves platinum. So every, that's pretty platinum. Reason. Every week, people just tune in every, for platinum. <laughs> everyone, yeah, that's every what, week. That's why they watch the show. Tier. Yo, I'm a hundred percent kind of like. Like, us, like, breaking this down every week is kind of making... Because in the whole anime community, I have not seen one person say a single word about that hey, anime. We got a monopoly you know on it, man. <laughs> we, yeah, we're, we're out yeah, here, man. We're because out people, here. people won't take the risk to, you know, review such yeah, a good right. show. Yeah, you're right. Everyone's watching My Dress Up Darling, bro. Everyone's like, right? oh, my God. <laughs> did, did Levi and Hanji kiss? Like, no. No one gives a shit about that. No one gives a shit. Only you should say that, Alan. They're, they're <laughs> caring about if Gojo I want to know. and cosplay waifu kiss. I don't know if Gojo oh, and yeah. And yo, kiss. Fire. Uh, by the way, guys, Fire Anime, please watch it. What Dress it? up. My, no, I don't oh, know. I haven't watched God. it. Is his name actually like Gojo? Yeah, yeah, his name's Gojo. Wow. Really? Kind of kind of the only reason really? why I stuck around for the peak first episode. Peak fiction fiction, bro. You see what yo. I mean? Once you put Gojo in your name, that's the... Yo, what if you change your name to Gojo so we can I'm get a, a pop bro, I'm about to name my kid Gojo. Gojo, <laughs> Aaron, and like fucking Natsu at the same time. Well, I'd probably fuck oh, up. you're getting three boys? How confident three boys, are you bro. getting three boys? I'd probably fuck know, up I... and name him Jogo and end up being the volcano head guy and just be like, fuck. What the fuck is up? <laughs> <laughs> I come out. I come out with a kid named Mojo Jojo because I. Fucked up. <laughs> <laughs> oh, and then my kid ends up growing up. I think I'm coming up. His kids ask his all the time. Whoa! What's wrong? Whoa! 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 whoa, 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 whoa. Can I, ask I just hope you know that <laughs> are the most resilient thing in the world because they be taking beatings. Anywho, yeah, that's true. That's actually, true. yo, cut that out. Yo, I have a job. Cut that out. Can Anywho. you not say that? <laughs> I don't know. I, I, don't, <laughs> I don't know. Okay, I'm a professional, bro. Okay, okay. I'm a professional. Right. I, I'm Hopefully, by the time okay. anyone finds this, we're already making millions. Okay? <laughs> or we're dead. <laughs> already. Or we're dead. <laughs> Assassinated. <laughs> One of those. <laughs> <laughs> One of those. Okay, anyways, back to my story. Sean yes. said we moved the pod. Oh, yeah, we're still And then that. when we realized, why did he move the pod? Did mm. he tell us why we moved the pod? No. But then he's just like, oh, shit, sorry. Seven days later, sorry, I forgot I had the concert. <laughs> then I was like, what? First of all, in my brain, I'm like, what concert? But did I say that? No, because I didn't mm -hmm. want to sound like a bad friend. Because maybe he told me and I just didn't know. <laughs> and I forgot, so I didn't want it to. So I'm just like, oh, damn, whatever. Yeah, let's do it. Uh... And, then I, and then I saw a Instagram story mm -hmm. of some random girl that was at Final Fantasy 7 concert and then I connected the two dots I was like usually when concerts come to town they do more than one day is that the fucking concert <laughs> that Sean was talking about and then I was like I told him about that I was supposed to go he to did. that what happened he did I forgot about it he forgot about I 100% for forgot that it existed and I didn't buy tickets oh, and man. now the day is here and I went outside to walk my dog and while he was taking a shit into the freaking grass I looked to my left and I see a big long line of people in suits and shit and I'm just like oh there's an orchestra going on in there <laughs> And I'm like, oh, it's that orchestra. It's right beside my house. It's literally like a five minute walk from my house. And it's right there. And Pain, I could have seen it, but now I can't see it. Such a tease. 
Now I can't see it. And That's pure pain. I'm upset um, because orchestras are amazing. I've seen two, I believe, in my life, and like the experience is just amazing. Uh-huh. And those were just from like random, like random um, people. Like I didn't know what yeah. the story was, but they, the way they like tell a story through music and stuff, and they have kind of like performers doing dances and stuff. Mm-hmm. But also like say video game awards or other like events, like seeing the orchestra play the orchestra music it's just like super cool on tv so see that on person was what i wanted to experience because i fucking love orchestras okay me too man. Love I, I i appreciate good orchestra uh, orchestra mm, me too i hope what mean I you? but <laughs> I the, next one, <laughs> the next one the next one hopefully we'll we can all go yeah okay? we'll like, all go to the next yeah Yo, you one. told me about this system. like two years ago this is a long yeah but it got moved because i, I was gonna buy co- things and it got moved immediately because of <laughs> covid yeah so then i was like i'll buy tickets later because i was poor at the time and i got moved again and it wasn't working and then i just toys. literally i forgot it it left my brain like there was so much shit going on in my mm-hmm. life like it wasn't even on my brain at all. and i didn't have a girlfriend at the time and now she's not going either so yeah, but you're going with your brother, you know? Yeah, not? I'm going with Josh and, and uh, his girlfriend. Who's Josh? Your you brother? Went from being yeah, like, my brother. They went from being, for, for Sean, I went from being a date. Josh, right? <laughs> really? <laughs> Wait, really? <laughs> I thought you were talking about Josh, the friend of your girlfriend. No. <laughs> you I was like, what kind of random? <laughs> I'm just bringing my girlfriend's <laughs> friends out to concerts <laughs> without I her. I was well, like, yo, why'd you ask him and not me? That's what a nice guy, man. Sean's a nice yeah. guy. You never, you know, you never know, uh, man. Yeah. yeah, but he should have asked me first, bro. Like, where, where, where's, what's, what's the point? Of I did. <laughs> the whole point of networking I was is like, to build these connections, I so I get into events I usually wouldn't get. Into. I was like, Andre, I'm booking the tickets now. Book yours, and you're like, ah. <laughs> 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 quote I, unquote. I honestly thought. No, listen. At that point of COVID, like every possibility outside of COVID, yeah, like seemed like it wouldn't exist. Yeah, that's like true. it didn't exist. That's true. It seemed like a dream. Like I just thought we were just gonna be in that forever. It was like a weird oh. pocket of life. Yeah, honestly, the only it reason... seems separate. It seems that. like a pocket dimension where it's like separate from the rest of reality. <laughs> the only yeah, reason I got weird. it was because I needed to get my brother and his girlfriend a Christmas present, and I was like, "What the fuck do I get?" And I was like, I guess I could get this all concert tickets. And I was like, oh, what concerts are out? And I was like, oh, yeah, Final Fantasy VII. <laughs> yeah, you That's told smart. me, you told us last week about how you and your brother did the the race to beat Final Fantasy VII shit, right? Yeah, we under 24-hour race. Yeah, Fire. Man. See? Hey, man, I got your back. That's all you got to know. Like, yeah. even when I don't benefit because some people forget to remind me things that are Jeez. important to me. <laughs> wow. Um... Well, all the sad, the blame do, on you, man. do you want to know the sadder thing? Is that his girlfriend has no idea what the hell Final Fantasy VII even is. And she's going. That's better. <laughs> I think that's the better thing, of it, to be do honest. Do you think so? You. Because when she experiences that music, she's going to be like, yo, what is this even? Yeah. And then, Maybe honestly, no, I'm lying to you. Like, I try and, <laughs> I try and convey, like, certain <laughs> things to her. Like, it's so crazy. Like, my girl, like, I try and convey <laughs> some of these things to her. And, mm-hmm. like... If it was in the form of a movie and or TV show, yeah. I know she would be, like, so into it. But literally, just because it's a video game, she's just like, eh. <laughs> You know what I mean? <laughs> I feel you. Like, she's, a, she's an avid anime watcher, bro. She loves Lord of the Rings. Like, if Elden Ring was a friggin' movie, mm-hmm. she would love it. But because it's in the medium of video games, automatically stick. My girlfriend knows everything. Yeah, yeah, your girlfriend's a gamer. She does Twitch and stuff. <laughs> yeah, tell her to join the pod, bro. Yo, tell her to watch. You, anime, you want her to the join pods. the pod? She, well, Steph, she's going join the to. pod. Shout out, Steph. She doesn't watch this. So. Nah. Yeah, she, well, nah. she's said all enough already. <laughs> she's like, I want to see Alan again. More. Hopefully, she doesn't, man. We make. I make a fool of myself on here. Nah, this is like. <laughs> Maybe, I don't know. Maybe act different around her. But since I've known you, you're no, pretty no, much no. exactly I the same. No, no, no. I definitely don't. Think <laughs> you're pretty much exactly yeah. the same. Yeah. No, I well. can't, man. I'm, I'm too lazy to pull up a facade. <laughs> what, like, fuck that, man. What am I supposed to do? <laughs> Alan's been like this since fucking day one, bro. That's day one, I brother. Know. Day one. I almost swore, like, for no reason there. Like, really badly. I, never mind. I, <laughs> 
<laughs> what does really badly mean? I like, like I would have had to actually stop and make sure I cut it, and I would have to apologize to everyone. Oh my everyone, God. like, I don't know, I don't know okay, what never mind. Say, yeah, yeah what? Right. what? Yo, speaking of okay, gaming, okay, okay, fine. Speaking of gaming, Andre has some incredible comments to talk about. Let's hear it. Hey, listen, guys, listen, guys, listen, guys, listen, guys, listen, guys. Listen. listen, guys. There's this game that came out recently yeah. called, um, it's a FromSoft game, From Software. Mm-hmm. Um, they make games yeah. such small as game. Demon's Souls, Dark Souls, um, yeah. Sekiro, small, small Bloodborne. Yeah, um, not yeah. exactly sure, like, people probably haven't heard of them because, like, they don't really make, their games aren't that good, you know what I mean? Like, nah, they're like pretty like, trash. Yeah, pretty trash to be honest. But they decided one day to just make like, you know what? Let's take our trash game and make it bigger and just put it in an open right. world. Let's try that. Maybe that'll work. Let's and see, I'm going to tell it. you right now, I'm lying to all your faces because all their games are great. <laughs> and this game is... <laughs> listen, I saw those reviews on Wednesday. There's been a lot of hype for this game. Literally yeah. just because it's been like... It got announced. Everyone was amped. And then nothing. Radio silence mm, for fucking years. Not a word from anybody. And then I just pop back up. Everyone was like, oh my god, this looks great. And god damn it, it is good stuff. Listen, I've ten. watched a lot of reviews. I've watched, watched a lot of... Like, I follow a few, like, Souls content creators. Just because, like, the lore is very interesting to me. But mm. I don't have the patience and or interest enough to like actually piece it together myself so mm-hmm. i go on youtube and watch other people piece it together for me and present <laughs> it to me and it's really interesting we love that but basically my point is like i've been watching all these guys watching interviews so like i've been getting a lot of positive feedback mm-hmm. and maybe that has influenced my like perception of the game but usually in that case when everyone's talking so much good shit about uh a thing and then I watch it like the first Avengers I watched it late everyone told me it was the best thing on the planet and I watched it and I was like eh <laughs> because yeah. but I think that was literally because of all the positive everyone told me it's the best thing I've ever seen and then yep. so I was expecting the best thing I've ever seen and it wasn't that but this is probably the one piece of media in any form that has had the hype that it's had and lived up to the hype to be completely honest with you Absolutely. all the reviews I don't know if you see on Metacritic has a 97 it has fucking hundreds of tens out of tens. There's Damn. so many tens out of oh, tens. So like many, all so over many. The place. Five out of fives, tens out of tens, like all over all the right. place. So, uh, so give us a breakdown, Andre. What's so great um, about this game? So, so basically, um, one, Dark Souls gameplay, the tightness, the the building. What, what word am I looking for? Like the togetherness, the polish. Polish is mm. what I'm looking for. That mm. is there in abundance, okay? So that, and now put that into an open world. Remember when I talked last week about Horizon and I said that it has an open world jank? Yeah. Mm-hmm. This doesn't have you open did. world jank. This mm. is like a fully fleshed out open world that works 100% of the time, all the time. Okay? Mm. And listen, I was, I'm addicted. Like I've, I'm addicted. Last week I said about <laughs> Elden Ring that I'm an old, I'm not Elden Ring, about Horizon. I'm an old man and I can't play games for hours on end anymore. Yeah. yeah I've lie. now realized it's because... <laughs> I games haven't had games. Shit now. That's fine. <laughs> all games are garbage. <laughs> They're all garbage compared to this. And like, it's literally just like, usually I hate old open world games because like I'm like we're adults. I don't have the time yeah. to be friggin' running across the open world. But literally, this is it's different. It's like a whole different experience. Like I find myself making the time. I'm at work and I'm just like, yo, like if I work, if I do all of these tasks really quick then I can just play Elden Ring <laughs> during my work hours because I finished yeah. all the thing real quick. Like, I'm really, like, I'm just, like, all in on it. It's amazing. Nice. Like, the open world itself is, like, it's a, something I've never experienced. Like, people say, like, Breath of the Wild um, has, like, one of the best open mm. worlds yeah. of all time. No, nah, no, nah, this is cut really? above. Open. Actually? Yeah, yeah. What's it's, yeah, like, it's I not just be, linear at all. Nothing. Like, I just... I told I was telling you guys before in the group chat like I've been thirty hours in I've I think I fought one boss like this is like a living breathing world it feels like this mm. isn't like I knew I already knew what the first like major boss was because of all the previews and stuff and then the network tests and all that kind of stuff so I knew that but like beyond that I have no idea so I don't know if I'm going in the right direction I'm just going all these places I'm just running around on my horse I like turn right 
because I'm like, oh, what's down this path? And then there's a cave. And then now mm -hmm. I'm in an underground city. And now there's a whole underground map. And I'm like, yo, there's a map under the map. And <laughs> I had no idea what was going on. <laughs> I'm so like weird. talking to people. They tell me to do things. Oh, you can do I'm that. like, oh, okay. I should... I should do this. And I just say, hey, let me do this. And then it opens up a whole new group of characters. And then they send me on a quest. And now there's a dragon. Now I'm running around. And there's a freaking <laughs> tree monster that just attacks me. And I'm like, bro, I was just doing my horse thing. I don't know. It's like, it weird. literally feels like a living, I was doing my horse world. thing. <laughs> yeah, I was just running on my horse. Like, I think I'm like, okay, I've done enough open world things. Let me go progress the story. But then now there's a big ass tree on my right. So I'm like, let me go over there. Let me see what's at the tree. Because like a big ass tree must be important. Now there's just a big ass tree monster there attacking me <laughs> with a stick. So now I got to fight the big ass tree monster. Was I too weak for it? Yep. But was I going to make that stop me? Nope. So Wait, now no. I'm an hour. Now I'm spending fight. an hour at the tree monster. You tried to fight a tree with a stick. <laughs> No, the tree hit me with the stick. It was oh. a big stick, though. <laughs> well, it basically it a big, is a stick. It was so. a big metal stick, though. Oh, shit. No, 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 no. You, have you ever played Demon? You've played Dark Souls, right? Yeah. yeah you know those yeah. big demon things? Those, um, like the Asylum Demon. Now, imagine that, uh -huh. but, like, make it a tree, okay. and then instead of, like, a staff, it's a metal stick. Make it That's a what yeah. it is. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> I love it. I have seen um, one thing from this game, and it's a it? guy on Instagram who has an account called "Can You Hug the Dog," and he just goes. You cannot. <laughs> you cannot. You and it, ju the dog. it shows him just his character going up to the dog with going his like arms this, up. and yeah, the dog eating his whole face on. Yes. <laughs> my, uh, my, my, favorite, my favorite clip I saw online was like. Um, you know, the heading was like, oh, when you've never played a Dark Souls game, um, but you, you buy, uh, Elden Ring and the guy's like squaring up to a goat, like shaking. Cause he doesn't know <laughs> if it's going to kill him or not. Obviously yeah. the goats aren't going to kill you, but he's heard so much shit about it. Yeah. Really? He's just, like, shaking, Yo, you should have like, seen this one, this one guy who was like, oh my God, my biggest, um, failure as a warrior. He goes to attack the goat. For some reason, the goat's a freaking roll. On the thing. So oh, he goes to attack like, the yeah. goat, the goat just dodges it and rolls down the hill and he completely misses and he's just like, oh shit. Yeah, that's what, I love that, man. I love that. Oh, yeah, man, I know. Every it's, time. it's honestly next level. And like, the reason what I mean, like, living and breathing, you know, like, okay, let's use an example because it's an open world game I recently played, like Horizon. Like, I look yeah. at a monster. And then I'm like, oh, shit, that thing's level 97. I can't fucking fight mm -hmm. that thing, obviously, because I'm a low level. Here, I have no idea until I'm like, <laughs> let's try. Let's right, try. Let's try. I friggin' slice it. I can't even see the damage I did. I'm like, maybe this is a bad idea. <laughs> <laughs> so then I have to run. That's and hilarious. it's so crazy in the sense where, like, you'll have, like, super weak things here. And then, right. like, a thing that will one-shot you, like, right beside each other. So, so I'm crazy. like, oh, my God. So it's literally, like, it's not, like... There's not an obvious progression unless, mm -hmm. well, like the sites of grace have like a direction thing. So you can kind of figure out the way to the end oh, of the true. game if you follow them. Mm -hmm. But even that, like you talk to the NPCs, they give you little hints about what you might need to do to move forward. They give you options like in this, there's this place where it's like, hey, you can take the, you can take the, you can figure out how to fix this lift. This lift's been used for years, but it's broken. You don't know. We don't know what's wrong with it. It's broken. We can't figure out how to fix it. Or you can take the coward's way out and freaking go downstairs and take the, the freaking tunnels. So I'm like, listen, I don't even know if it's possible, but now I'm trying to figure out a way to fix this lift because you're not calling me a coward out here <laughs> to, no. to take the freaking Hell tunnel no. routes. I got to figure yeah, right. out how, if this lift works or not. All right. So right. like things like that. I so, don't know. I don't okay. know. It's... It's something special, guys. It's sounds good. This is the feeling like I haven't gotten from video games in like. Oh know, yeah, know, really? It's, okay. I I had I didn't know it was open world. I thought it was just like another Dark Souls, but more like no, uh, fantasy, or uh, with like dragons, like Skyrim. Uh, yeah, Skyrim, Dark Souls, basically. Um, nah, it's I, open world, bro. It's, it's, 100 it's open. open it's world. like super open world. Like I, what Andre was saying about like you don't know anything. Like this guy was like, oh, there's this like monster pulling a cart. 
Let me just go hit him. And he goes and like taps his foot, and the guy literally lifts his foot and just crushes the shit out of the guy. What the hell? Bro? Immediately. Yeah. And the guy's just yeah, you like, you know, what? like Dark Souls giants, how like friggin' trash yeah. and slow they are? Mm -hmm. Yo, this is the best giant. Like, this <laughs> feels like what a giant would be. Like, yeah, their like arm swings you. are real slow. But, like, when they stomp, bro, like, you have a slow weapon, you'll slice and be like, oh, look at that damage, and now I'm under his foot. <laughs> and <laughs> and I'm dead. Exactly. Exactly. <laughs> Yo, it's honestly ridiculous. And so many enemies, like, accommodate the horse. Like, you think you're on a right. horse, you're like, I'm invincible, I'm fast, you can't catch me. And <laughs> then this giant freaking swings his sword across the map, and then I'm like, oh. <laughs> oh, I guess, I guess that's oh. not how this goes. Yeah, really. <laughs> Yeah. yeah. So it's it's some it's honestly it's something special. Like I recommend yeah. listen. It all the only negative things I see about this game come from people who obviously no, aren't souls. It's kids. You know honestly, what I mean? and don't and don't take me wrong, it's kids. Like that I, we talked about this in one of our other pods. Like um, games nowadays, and this is the reason why we kinda mm. don't like them, really hold your hand. Where yeah. this is a prime example of a game that literally does not want to hold your hand at all so the the kids are like oh this game is still hard there's no instructions and all that like I no, people that's are the getting whole point. mad that there's no quest log yeah like, there's no quest log at all really? like if you, you want to keep track yeah. of what your quests are like you gotta <laughs> write it down, write it down. <laughs> and be like i found the person in this area oh in this my place. god like i found this lady and she told me to do something she's like oh there's an abandoned house over there and she didn't tell me what direction to go. She just said it's over, down the way. There. So I'm like, oh shit, now I gotta go find this house. And I spent freaking 20 minutes finding the house. I found the house, talked to him, and I'm like, oh shit, where was that old la where was the lady? So I have to go oh, find shit. the lady. <laughs> right? But like little things like that. It's like, I don't know, it feels like real world, like stuff like yeah. how it would be. Oh, like yeah, it's sure. very immersive in that kind of sense. And so there's a lot of NPCs that you can communicate, that you can like, yeah, they're with. everywhere. Oh, they're okay. scattered That's around. Hard. And, like, it's the same thing. It literally has a Dark Souls formula where someone will be like, yo, do this for me. Mm -hmm. And then you can say no or, or yes. And okay. then some yeses may result in the death of another NPC. Or, because, <laughs> like, um, I saw a YouTuber. He was breaking it down. He's basically said, the reason why there's no quest log is because quests can't play out. Don't play out in linear fashion. Mm -hmm. yeah. Like, everybody's in the game, their quests, they, they progress with or without you. Like, no one's just standing right. in one spot waiting for you the entire game to come talk to you. Like, you might meet a guy first hour, or you may meet him friggin' 60 hours in, and then the way his crest plays out is completely different depending on where you meet him. Oh, a lot of absolutely. stuff in Dark Souls where That's you can crazy. talk to someone and kind of guide them in different directions so they don't die, but if you don't meet them early, like, mm -hmm. they'll either end up dead or they end up hollowed, and then you have to end up fighting them instead of, like, and, like, all these kind of things, like, these play out the same kind of way. Oh, wow. Absolutely. That sounds great. Yeah, so, yeah, it's, it's, like, like and I'm gonna tell you this, like, I don't think there's been a single pair of people who's had the same exact experience going forward. Really? No, it's so, it's all just yeah, different. It's yeah, man. completely That's crazy. different. No wonder it took people so long. People meet different NPCs. They have different items. They have different bills. They reach different people in different mm -hmm. orders. Mm -hmm. Like, there is no, like, set path throughout this. And that's why quest logs can't exist. Yeah. They can't. They huh? can't exist, man. Okay. Like, it's, it's crazy stuff, man. It's, yeah. like, the amount of work I can see into this, this is next level man like, mm -hmm. no, this is what this is what open world games should be honestly yeah and even just like decision making games or exploring games like like so many yeah. games try to do this and fail because it either ends up being oh like all these things gave me different choices <coughs> but it all just ends up converging right. yeah. to the same point and then you're mm -hmm. like oh well it doesn't feel like anything i did mattered then but mm -hmm. like exactly. the way you're describing it really makes it seem like you have a different experience every time you play it yeah, you can just kill NPCs. You got like, oh, this really? is the thing that's been a soul. Like they can give me a whole grand journey, and I mm. can just be like, you know what? What item are you gonna drop? And I can just murder them on the spot, and then it'll just be over. Have you? <laughs> no, I actually haven't because I'm scared. I'm scared to do it. <laughs> I'm, scared. <laughs> I'm scared to do it. I don't want to lose anything that can give me something important. You know what I mean? That's it. Yeah. And it has that's the same it. concept of like collecting souls. Is that a thing still? So. Yeah, they're they're called runes in this game. Okay, yeah. and then you lose them when you die. And, like they're there for one more life. Or... Yeah, all okay. that. And okay. this time, you don't have to memorize where they were because it's an <laughs> open world map. Sometimes you just die in the middle of a field, <laughs> so they have like a compass at the top, yeah. and it will direct you towards where your runes mm. are. So where's your um, Where do you spawn when you die? 
Sites of Grace. So basically, they're okay. bonfires. All right. They're basically nice. bonfires. But they also added this thing called Stakes of America, which are a lot closer to bosses usually. America. So the whole Dark Souls run back problem is pretty much alleviated so far for me in most cases. Okay. It's alleviated. Nice. Because everyone knows that's the biggest yeah complaint of a lot of people i used to hate that dark souls it's like why am i running like i yeah. fight this boss guy so bad bro. they run so, so far horrible, yeah, yeah. The, the last boss for me was the one that pissed me off the most you had to like oh. run through this like underworld and then like there's two like big night guys that like block you and then you have to like oh to for them. gwen yeah for yeah gwen. and i'm just like yeah. fuck like just spawn me next to the freaking entrance yeah. like this I'm isn't hard right it's now. just annoying i'm telling you right now i talked about this on this pod dark souls 2 that fucking that snow, that snow oh, thing, yeah. which was literally like a friggin' five to ten minute run back. <laughs> Every <laughs> time you die. Oh, man. Was something. <laughs> That's all something. I'm saying. It was <laughs> something. And um, also, I want to say quickly, like a lot of, like, a lot of people... Mm. Like, the way they handle difficulty in this game, or the way they added an easy mode, is so ingenious. They don't have... An easy mode. They give you so many options yeah. to make yep. the game easier mm -hmm. that you have to go find. You, like the first boss is called Margaret the Felloman, whatever. Like mm -hmm. if you are stuck on him, he's too hard. Like if you go and explore, you can find an item called Margaret's Shackles, which will literally render him immobile for parts of the game game and then you can like tack him where he's like a little bit for a little bit of time but yep. the fact that you have to go out into the world to find these kind of things yeah. it's like it's not an easy mode they're not making they and then they have the spirit summons they have ashes of war skill moves um magic like different magic things like exploiting bosses weaknesses like all of these things like if you use every tool in your arsenal you can make this game a cakewalk but oh, yeah. Oh, it's yeah. not a cakewalk unless you put in the work. Yeah. To make it a that's cakewalk. Fair. Get that that's grind. Why... Or, or they just ridicule you, right? Mr. Uh, not going okay, under the good. bridge <laughs> or whatever. <laughs> 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 yeah, they fucking make me feel like shit. I don't know. <laughs> yeah. I might still go under the bridge. We'll see where I am right now. Yeah. Like, I, like, I found a map that said, here's a glimpse of stone key. It's right here. We have to go to a meeting place. And it was like a it was like a rock formation in the middle of an ocean, mm -hmm. but I'm not. It was like not an actual ocean. It's like a marsh, so it's like it's like walkable, but it's like okay. water. So I'm like, I don't know where this is because <laughs> you have to like find map fragments to unlock parts of the map. Oh. But the part that it showed me, I haven't unlocked yet, and I still haven't unlocked. There's I've been to so many places in this world where like I have no idea what the terrain looks like. I'm just kind of like stumbling on things. I don't know <laughs> where the map fragments are or anything. So I'm just kind of like experiencing it this way, and I'm just like, just winging it. I'm I don't just know what it is. It. And then, and then I'm like, you know what? I remember there's a dragon in this place. Let me go fight this dragon because the weapon I have is stronger than it was before. Because like I, I attacked it the first few times, I yeah. was doing minimal damage, and I was getting one shot at every time. So mm -hmm. I was like, okay, obviously, obviously, listen, in Dark Souls fashion, I could have spent out, but listen. 30 hours and <laughs> one out of five dungeons completed like main dungeons uh -huh, i'm like yeah. listen i don't think this is the one where i should be spending hours on bosses because in bloodborne there's this boss called orphan of chaos uh, yeah. no orphan of is that what it's called orphan of chaos fuck i forget his name wow. cause it's all... orphan oh, of cause yeah, yeah that's it's basically the last boss of the DLC, and he fights you with a bladed placenta, right? Yes, Anyways, yes. the first time I beat it, recently, the last time I, I re-beat Bloodborne like a month ago. I think I talked about it here. Um, before I, or after I did Dark Souls 2, I think. Mm -hmm. But um, it didn't take me that long. It took me like an hour or so to like finish it, but like it took me like three days to beat that thing. Holy shit. But like really? in Elden Ring, like there's so much to experience and I want to experience. Like spending three hours on a boss is so like, unappealing <laughs> you know what I mean <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. Uh, of course unappealing to me but the great thing about it is it gives you the option like do that if you want go ahead just go ahead figure out the intricacies or just leave go somewhere else get stronger find something yeah. come back and it's mm -hmm. easy now so when like, you're give you so many options when you're running around me. the game like how often yeah. do you run into enemies like all the time like, like it's the most densely packed really like point of interest like 
game I've like ever seen. You know, like in Breath of the Wild, mm-hmm. there's just long ass stretches of nothing. Mm-hmm. That's not that doesn't exist here. Really? Yeah, like they're everywhere. There's something at all times. Like this is really? like a real world. It feels like yeah, man, oh, yeah. It's, yeah. it's ridiculous, man. Actually, I, I promise you, you if you've it. ever Honestly, you love if it. you've ever played yeah. if you've oh, yeah. ever played a Souls game, if you've ever played an action RPG, like just. I, I promise just you, do give it. it a chance. Yeah, just just <laughs> give it a chance. Give it a chance. I right. promise you, like, it's difficult in the sense, like, it's Souls difficulty, but they, this is the first one. Um, I think someone was talking about how this is easier than the rest. But, like, it's really? because... Yeah, but it's only because they give you so many more options mm. to make mm. it easier mm. than ever before. True. You don't have to use. My first instinct, every time I go to a boss, I'll never use my spirit summons. Ever. Um, um, unless, like, I've hit walls before where I'm just like, you know what? Okay. I'm just using my spirit summons. Yeah. This is a side boss. It's not the main boss. <laughs> Let me just use it because I don't want to be stuck here right now. And I want to see what the loot is. Like, I find a random cage, a random cave. And then the one thing is, like, a lot of the cave dungeons, like, their layout, not their layout, the aesthetic is pretty much similar. I'm yeah, across right. and I have kind of the same enemies. But I just think that's because there's like there's probably like hundreds of them like scattered throughout. <laughs> so like making all of them completely unique is probably next to impossible. Mm. And True. this map is ridiculous. Like it starts zoomed in, but it doesn't tell you that. Until oh. you find a place over here and then yeah. you check the map, and I'm just like, that wasn't there before. How did I get here? And now it's bigger. <laughs> And then, so I personally don't know how big the map gets. Like, yeah. it's huge. And there's actual points with actual useful items spread throughout. And there's specific NPCs that you can miss. Like, um, wow. the spirit summons that I just talked about, it. like, I got the bell to summon them from a witch that only, I only saw, I think you have to go to a merchant and then go back to the merchant and then she'll be there. Mm. Really? But if I just go to Merchant, buy what I need, and then just move on with my journey, I'll just never have the spirit summon job. Ever. Jeez. Really? That's crazy. Yeah. And then the torch that, that I that I bought from this merchant, I've only so far I've only seen at this one merchant. And there's been like dark ass like dungeons that I've had to go through that needed wow. the torch. That's a while. And like so it'll just like not give you things. Like the <laughs> the whole big move thing, like Ashes of War. Mm-hmm. I had yeah. to Go through like an enemy camp, dig like go underground and like find it in this like special thing. Like I didn't just have mm-hmm. it, so like it's possible for you to just never find this and then just never have Ashes of War, which is a huge like addition to this game. Like, there's right, so many right. different things in this where like it's possible you just never get it, like ever. <laughs> <laughs> so like I don't know, it's like real. Like when I say yeah. it's real world, it's a real world. Bro. That's awesome. Is there a multiplayer? Yeah. <laughs> Is it in the yeah. sense that like the other games have it? Like you can warp in and just help people with bosses. Yeah. Okay. Like okay. Um, you can kind of run through the open world. Um, I I've never done it. But I've heard some people explain it where it's kind of like same thing. You drop your summoning sign. Mm-hmm. You you invite the person, then they can help you in the open world. But if they enter a dungeon, then you kind of gotta leave the world. You reappear back at where you first laid the sign. You've mm-hmm. got to run to the same place that the second person is in and then mm-hmm. lay another sign and they can, they can uh, summon you back into the world. Gotcha. gotcha. But the good thing <laughs> is, is like apparently the souls or the runes that you get don't um, carry over. So if you die, mm-hmm. like if it's your world and you die, then you, you lose your souls, but I keep mine. So I can Ooh. use it. So if I help you be the boss, and then you help me be the boss, we can double up on runes. Pretty Damn, much. man, that's not that's not a bad system, actually. That's I yeah. like that a lot. Yeah. yeah, it's 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 kind of archaic, but at the same <laughs> time, like, hey, man, Dark Souls, it is Dark Souls, is. exactly. <laughs> it is. It is. <laughs> yeah. do what they want. I mean, it's hard enough. Yeah. Just take what you can get. <laughs> hey, man, just think of it this way. This is the longest anyone has ever, any of us have ever talked about any video game. So. Well, I you, mean, think, you mean you? <laughs> I mean, y'all ask me questions. That's true. Wait, I'm telling you, Sean, you've liked. I want to play it now. It's for PS4, you've right? Liked, yeah, it's PS4, Good. PS5. Both. Good. Yeah. 
PS4, uh, PS5, think... PC, um, Xbox, all, all this, all this shit. Awesome. Yeah. Just from what I've heard, um, people, like people that Alan, have waited Alan, you like for... Skyrim, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah. yeah, yeah for sure. I honestly think you would like it. I honestly think like you should try to... Nice. Like, even if, like, I know you're, like, a Twitch where you're doing, like, a lot of competitive stuff now, but I think, like, in your off time, like, I know, like, do you not ever play video games just for you and not have to worry about Yeah, Twitch? yeah. No, I I, I played, um, like, the Lost Ark game, like, on on stream as well, just to, like, grind it out. Yeah, it's a no, good... I um... honestly think, I honestly think, like, um, you two and, like, me, like, I don't play games where I have people where I can talk to them about. You know what I mean? Yeah. yeah, yeah. So, like, this is part of the reason why I started the podcast. Like, I at least get the anime part of the, out of the way, but mm-hmm. literally, like, the, the games game. I play, like, no <laughs> one I know plays these. Right? <laughs> yeah. I have, like, one, like, my cousin plays Horizon, but no one I actively talk to is, like, an avid gamer like me. You know what I mean? Yeah, yeah. Mm-hmm. So, it's... Yeah. Elden no, Ring, I think, is the one. Because Alan is the one who got... I'm not Alan. Uh, Sean is the one who got me into FromSoft in the first place. He's mm-hmm. the one... I, like, I literally said, hey... Sekiro's on sale for 50 bucks. Should I get it? And Sean's like, do it. It's great. And I'm like, all right. I did it. Boom. Then I got then I got Sekiro. Mm-hmm. And then I was like, oh, shit. Dark Souls 1 is on sale on my Switch. So while I'm playing Sekiro, I can try that on my Switch. Like when I'm hanging out with my girl or whatever, she's watching TV. Yeah. I can play Dark Souls handheld, right? And then I got into that. And obviously, it's just like, oh, shit. This is a thing now. <laughs> and then Bloodborne was on PlayStation Now. Mm-hmm. For free, and I was like, I'm gonna have to try that. And I borrowed it from my cousin like years ago, but like the first friggin' part was so hard, I kept dying. <laughs> I'm like, I'm never playing this shit again. <laughs> but like, I went back to it with the Dark Souls oh, and the yeah. Sekiro experience, and I'm like, I'm gonna do this now. And I did it. Then Dark Souls 3, then Demon Souls Remake came yeah. out, and I got my PS5. I was like, I have to do that. <laughs> And then finally, Dark Souls 2. Played, like, all of them. Elden Ring. Honestly, yeah, after I'm playing... Fine. I don't know if everyone has, uh, like, experience, but after playing Sekiro, the rest just feels so, like, so much easier. I did not... I, I sucked yeah. at Sekiro. Okay, I was say, so bad. You say Sekiro... Because Sekiro, Sekiro is a rhythm game. A lot yeah. of people say it's a rhythm game. Yeah, that's yeah. why I suck at You saying that, though, uh, you should definitely give Elden <laughs> Ring a try, because that... Uh, Elden Ring. Because that, that shit will get you so pissed. Like... Because it's all, I, as you know, it's uh, one mistake and you're gone, right? Like, that, uh, from what I've seen. Um, That's yeah. why you got to get what they call bitch figure. You get as much life as possible, it increases the amount of mistakes you have <laughs> to make in a boss There you battle. go. There you go. <laughs> yeah, sure. Um, but yeah, I, 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 I think uh, from just like, because I, like Andre said, I play a lot of competitive stuff, like ranked. But um, there's 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 a time for those games where you just need to sit there and just grind it. I promise it you, if you have any interest in like fantasy and mm-hmm. lore, you'll get lost in it. Oh yeah, oh yeah, for sure. Yeah, so, like, for sure. I, I'm Shit. telling you, I haven't been addicted to anything ever. Like, look how easy it was for me to leave Horizon. Like, I've been playing it nonstop for a week, <laughs> yeah. like every day. And Elden Ring came, and I'm just like, eh, whatever. <laughs> like, you know what I mean? I just moved mm. on to it. Yeah. Like, Horizon is. And that's yeah. You know, it's, well, that's not to say that Horizon is bad. It's just like, no, it's it's a it's great game. Yeah. I love Horizon yeah. Zero Dawn, but that's what I'm saying. Elden Ring is special. Mm-hmm. Elden um, Horizon Forbidden West is a great game, and I will get back to it. But Elden Ring is special, and I what haven't I'm, said that about any game in a very long time. Like, what I'm waiting is for special. is like those weirdos that like finally beat the game. And they're like, all right. Now time to do speed run and post on YouTube and, and figure uh, this yeah. out. Yeah, speed runs. You know I mean? <laughs> speed runs of Dark Souls is like one of my favorite videos to watch. They're just oh, like, they're hey so man, beautiful. all you gotta do is you drop down here, then you fall seven meters, then you run through this wall because it's a glitch. So you just run yeah. through the wall, you just run and then the you wall. get over here. And like, so what do you gotta do for this boss? Is you get this weapon with this build, and then you kill him, parry, parry, repost, parry, repost, <laughs> parry, repost. Then he's dead. And I'm just like. Yeah. Guys, you did that in seven seconds. I was stuck on this boss for like fucking seven hours, bro. Like, what are you doing right now? It was the greatest well, thing. Ever. Andre, I'm looking forward to the, uh, the, uh, <clears throat> sorry, the Elden, uh, the Elden Ring Orchestra in 2026. Get some tickets for that. Yeah, yeah. we love that. Music we love is that. Great. All right, let's all, let's all, let's all that, bring back past that, that, that fucking yo. Honestly, guys, 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 we're 45 minutes in at this rate. Yeah. We're actually not gonna talk about it. <laughs> oh, so let's I don't, get to Attack on Titan. Wait, wait. No, let's get to Attack on Titan before we get oh, to Attack on Titan. Oh shit! Let's talk about Pokemon first. Uh, I don't know. Uh, yeah, what is there to say? Okay, wait. What do you want to talk about before? 
Oh, I just wanted to talk about how Blue Lock is going to be like up oh, and running God. soon. Okay, yeah, the... talk about it. We're not talk getting about it. Boji. No. Cool, cool, cool. Actually, talk no, 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 no. <laughs> talk about Pokemon first. Because you want to talk about Blue Lock. Okay, yeah. Let's hear it. Got Pokemon it. first. All right, all right, ladies and gentlemen, it is that time again where we talk about Pokemon because that's all we can figure out. And judge um, it. And, and, for and judge so. it. Absolutely. So, uh, this past <laughs> week, or if for anyone who's watching it later, uh, doesn't matter because time is relevant. Um, exactly. Pokemon released uh, a little thing on their Pokemon Day, and uh, you know it started off being like, "Here's an update for this game. Here's an update for that game." And then everyone's like, "Ooh, is this Arceus? Is this an expansion to Arceus?" Mm -hmm. And Pokemon's like, "No, we want you to spend eighty more dollars on a new game." So what Pokemon uh, is said to release is Pokemon Violet and mm -hmm. Scarlet, I believe they're called. Yeah. Um. Honestly, so what? From what I'm getting, from what people have have uh, got from the trailers and like leaks and all that, is that. They took the engine of, of Arceus, literally built uh, Violet and uh, Scarlet. So essentially what the games are then is an open world Pokemon mm -hmm. game with gyms, with with gym leaders. Finally, thank and God. So exactly. So that's what everyone's waiting for. But everyone's all pissed because they're like, wait, you literally just released Arceus like yeah. a month ago, two months ago. Mm -hmm. And then you're saying that was the beta to a game that you wanted to release later. Like, what the frig? So, um, no, that they, they look cool. I love the starter Pokemons. I don't have the names up, but we have um, Green Kitty. We have Red Frog. And we have Blue Donald okay. Duck. I need some I need some explaining. Green, green Kitty is the most generic looking. Fucking yeah, yeah you're, right. you're right. It is. But I need some explaining, okay? Why? Okay. What is with these comments on the Green Kitty better stay caught ca through pedal? People are like, oh, it better not become bipedal in any of its evolutions. Have you guys seen not seen that? What? Oh, so like it's is that like a thing that happens where like usually they like. I think I guess so, but feet? like I keep seeing comments where people are like this freaking cat better not turn bipedal or else I'm gonna be pissed. Okay, let's let's break this shit down. Oh, you <laughs> got, just, oh, I understand. We that. got Squirtle, <laughs> who stays bipedal the whole time. We got Squirtle's not a cat. <laughs> no, I'm trying to break down the starters. Infernape? I don't know if this ever happens. I think there's an Infernape. Yeah, but that's bipedal the whole time too. I think they're just oh, talking about cats. Two uh, chars are bipedal. Insinior, 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 insinior. Incineroar. In, yeah. Oh, I don't. That's that's like beyond my Pokemon knowledge. I don't know about those ones. <laughs> yeah, those Which are, one those was that? Was that Sun and Moon? Was that that one? I think mm. so. X and Y is. Oh shit. Actually, no, I don't know. No, I don't remember who the X was. Yeah, yeah, Incineroar was uh, all fours. He was a cat. He was a cat. Yeah, but yeah. who is... He was Lin He was li uh, Litten, and then he was uh, Tora Cat. All fours, by the way. Then Incineroar, he becomes a wrestling, bipedal, just monster. <laughs> Beast. Yeah. Beast. Okay. Um, but it would have been like Growlithe. Well, well, Growlithe only had two evolutions, though. The first one... That? Oh and my Arcanine. god! An Arcanine. Arca yeah, yeah, Arcanine is a dog. <laughs> yeah, there's some weird people out here. You ever Gravel seen? Uh... is also a dog. What? Are you what? About? Growlithe? <laughs> Growlithe oh. is a dog, bro. Oh, uh, take one of my Pokemon license. I was thinking of uh, Meowth. Obviously. Oh, yeah. He goes from bipedal to quadrupedal though. That's yeah, that's backwards. I'm so this confused. This is why. That's the first thing I thought of when I thought of cat Pokemon. Meow. And I was like, what do you mean? This one is. I don't know. It confused me. I don't know why. That's all right. That's all right, man. Yeah. That's interesting. Um, but yeah, that's um, that's pretty much that's pretty much what came out for Pokemon. There are some like Pokemon Go stuff and all that, but mainly they're releasing a game that everyone's hey, like. I don't yeah. care about any of the other stuff. We're yeah. talking about the new generation, bro. That's yeah. what we're talking about. Scarlet that's and Violet. Purple is my favorite color, so Violet seems pretty lit to me. I might lit. actually, I might finally dip into the Pokemon. We'll see. Jeez. We'll see when the video's coming. Because yeah. this is what happened with Sword and Shield. I was amped for it literally until like the month before it came out, and mm -hmm. I was just like, nah. You were looking at. <laughs> You were and like, it was the same thing with Arceus. Yeah, no, I was going to say that. Brother. Arceus too. I was like all in on it consistently, and then like a like. When did it come out? January. Re Release day. February. February. Like, yeah. Literally, I was just like, like a month ago. Yeah. I was like, never mind. Yeah, I don't want it. So, I feel that too. We'll see. We'll Everyone's see, pissed because like, it's literally it's literally going to be Arceus with gyms and and gym leaders and uh, and, and like Thank missions God. and shit. But well, why are they mad though? Yeah, why because they, they released they Arceus, they're like, why, why, why not, why not really? Yeah, they yeah, pay eighty bucks. But why not? Isn't it not better to have two games and? I think maybe they wanted to them to maybe people are gonna be mad regardless, right? So yeah, so just wait. Maybe if they can't afford both games in 
this year, yeah. which is totally understandable. Mm-hmm. Wait until you can. So like, guys, if you could is, only afford one Andre Pokemon game a, a year. Talking. This is Andre. That no, has no, no. A job but listen, 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 listen. I said, say, it, get your I money said it earlier your today. <laughs> no, no, no. I said it earlier today. Like when I when I launch Elden Ring, and yeah. you know, like at the bottom it says like Ben and Emco 2022, hmm. and like copyrighted 2022. Like I used to be amped as shit when yeah. I would see the copyright in the same year that it was. Because usually I would never get a game in the same year that it released. So I would mm-hmm. be in fucking 2015 playing 2014 games, you know? Mm-hmm. And it would be copyright 2014. And I'm just like, this is old. But, like, every once in a while, it'd be, like, 2017, and then it would say copyright 2017, and I'd be, eh. But my point, <laughs> all, to say all that is to say, like, if you can't afford two games this year, that's totally understandable. Just get Broke the single bitch. one next year. Why do you have to be... Why do you have to get it? As it's it not cool out? anymore, Andre. If you but just because you got, Ar- Ar- but just because you got Arceus, it doesn't make this next one. And True. Like, it's a different game. It's not going to be. Yeah, the same I know. Thing. But I think they're disappointed because like Arceus was like a new idea, um, that was like a big difference from the older games, and right. like to so and quickly move back, back to, to the original game. formula, it seems kind of like they're, like without, especially without polishing Arceus first, feels like a bit like they're giving up or. Be- like, this was just a gimmick that they threw out. But I don't think Arceus is going to be gone. I, no, like, I don't think, think so either. You'll have your, like, your Legends, and yeah. then your mainline Pokemon, and your Legends. But, mm-hmm. like, different... Like, they'll be different, like, timelines kind of thing. Like, they'll be yeah. in conjunction with each other, but, like, different. Just like how earlier, a couple years ago, they had Let's Go, and then they had the mainline. Then they had Brilliant Diamond, Brilliant sure, Pearl, yeah. and Arceus this time, right? Mm-hmm. So, like, they... Like, the last, like three years they've had two they had let's go then sword and shield mm-hmm. and then brilliant diamond brilliant pearl then they had arceus and now they'll have well i guess that doesn't kind of work but they have arceus and <laughs> they have arceus and scarlet and violet yeah. yes all i'm saying is i'm glad they went back to colors because sorry i hiccup but i'm um, <laughs> glad they went back to cur- colors because sword and shield was kind of meh yeah um Vi- uh, purple is my favorite color, so mm-hmm. I hope the legendary for Violet. Um, I will yeah, say I too that like I, the thing with Pokemon is I really want to go, uh, not back per se, but I want it to get hard again. You know, because Pokemon games are way too easy now, and it's way too handholdy as we've talked about before. And that's just yeah. like I, Paul, I want that. Paul, loves, I, Paul, I said Paul. Sean, lo- Sean loves when it gets Paul. hard. You know. Yeah, my bad. My I don't know what, what kind of Paul you know that likes getting hard, it's, it's, Alan. Oh uh, um, uh, oh and uh, yeah, thank you. you. Well, but well, anyways, he set me up. Okay, uh, or himself up. What I was saying is that I, re- I'm really waiting for them to get back to like, like to to say maybe like a Dark Souls kind of Pokemon where it's actually really tough. What the fuck. And not the gameplay, but like Yo, the, you're just the difficulty. Along, Mewtwo, Mewtwo just fucking fucks you up. No See, reason. listen, Dark Souls Pokemon is like you walk outside the friggin' yeah, you get your first starter Pokemon and Mewtwo's outside, bro. That's Dark Souls Pokemon. Bro. You turn around, you look at the tall grass. Uh, there's fucking Mewtwo and there's Mew standing in both grass grasses that you have to yeah, walk through. That's basically freaking Ash with Pikachu every episode. Anyways, like what's the that's difference? True. You see, he gets away with it. Yo, Ash Ashley. has been playing on Dark Souls difficulty this whole time. That's why he's so bad. <laughs> he's the goat, bro. Ash is the goat. Uh, um, Do they still make shows? But he won, didn't he? So what's the point? Eventually, like yeah. he fought, but he won like a couple years ago. So like, yeah, he can't keep making the anime. What's the uh, point? Oh yeah, and uh, he looks so weird now. Uh, I can't do it. Yeah, he looks. It looks cartoony more than yeah anime. Yeah, it's it weird. is what it is though. But that's pretty much Pokemon news. Um, a bunch of updates, but wait, also wait new a news. second, bro. I need to know what's your starter, bro. Oh, you're asking me oh. what my starter is for which gen? This one, the, the new one, the new one, the Violet. The new one. Oh, sure. I, I'll tell you, I know. Fucking, what you've been doing. Obviously, fucking Donald Duck. Who else am I gonna pick? Oh, really? You're going for Donald, huh? Yo, oh, Coco. For Donald. Coco. Mm. What's his name? Coco Sita. <laughs> Who? I'm going the for the Fue Coco, Fue Coco. <laughs> Who the fuck is Fue Coco? The the duck? That's the that's no, that's the fire crocodile. Yeah, I'm going for him too. Fuck for, fuck Fue, Fue Coco. He looks like that's the, the, the guy. He looks like that game where you cut the orange thing to make him eat it. 
He looks like the Yo, guy we're going that to eats Spain, it. right? We're going to Spain, right? right? Like Sprigatito. Yo, yeah, you're saying Spain. he's going to get a sombrero. You're saying he evolves that's into Spanish getting a sombrero. Yeah, are you talking about Busta Move, the, the little dragon <laughs> who shoots the bubble? Bubble Bob? Bubble Bob? Yes, he looks like Bubble Bob. <laughs> he does. He does, actually. He does. He does look like that. Oh, my God. But, yeah, I'm going yeah. with uh, Fire Crocodile as well. Cause See, but that's, like, the common crocodile. thing. Fuck I know. Everyone I know. wants that but one. I and haven't like, gone for Fire. At first look... That is the best looking one. Yeah, yeah. But I mean, like, yo, Quaxley has drip, though, bro. That fucking hairdo, bro. Quaxley. <laughs> Quaxley, bro. That hairdo, don't, bro. Don't fuck with Quaxley, bro. <laughs> I just took that, that in. Do, I just took that in. I never realized that before. His name's Quaxley. Realize what? His name's Quaxley. What's, what's wrong with Quaxley? Bro? Quack. <laughs> That's. <laughs> <laughs> it's yo, a pun, kind of. Yo, he, he got me. that. He got that Tell back. me so I can have a better a, reason. He's a it. duck, and Quack is in his name. Okay, is that? Oh, that's all. <laughs> that's all it is. I didn't realize that before. Now it just sounds yeah. amazing. You're laughing at. You're laughing at his name. He's laughing at your bank account, bitch. Because he's oh, that guy's dripping. <laughs> I don't know. This better be good. All I know is because I have to buy um, Mario Strikers and Splatoon oh, 3. So if this game isn't fucking. Shit. Yo, if this I game isn't could, banging, oh, I don't I have the money you. for it. So Bro, someone, someone, mm-hmm. someone fucking said, yo, this is Quaxley's evolution. Oh, you can't see it because it's is too bright. Is that Super Saiyan 4? Is that Super Saiyan Goku? I hear it's through the hair. Uh-huh. Yeah, yeah, it's Super Goku. Saiyan blue, bro. It's crazy. <laughs> oh, my. Yeah, what's wrong with people, man? What's wrong? So with we it? have anyway. Blaziken, Infernape, then it, then um that pig yeah. one, mm-hmm. oh, okay. Incineroar, yeah. and then after Incineroar was um, um the the bunny, right? The soccer <laughs> okay, bunny. Okay, but after the bunny, after the bunny was the one we were just talking about with the wrestling, right? The soccer bunny was the newest oh, one. Oh, it was Sword and Shield, wasn't it? Was it? I don't know. Yeah, Sword and Shield was the soccer bunny. Bro, I don't know. I never played Sword and Shield, bro. That game looked trash to me, bro. I didn't like it. <laughs> I don't know. I didn't Fair. play X and Y. I didn't play X and Y either. I didn't play Sun and Moon. Black and White. Literally, the last one. Oh, I yeah. Know for sh- Sun and Moon. Sun and Moon was trash. It was after, X- was after X and Y. Literally, the only one I know for sure is like friggin' Diamond and Pearl, bro. That's mm. the last one I know for sure. <laughs> and that's in for Nate, bro. <laughs> that's all I can say. <laughs> that, that's a while. I don't know, what happened. Time, I don't yeah. know what happened after that. Yo, um, sun, sun and Moon is when it got handholdy, and I was like, yo, screw this. This is terrible. There are no this, gyms. Yeah. It some people like the people you start with are with you the entire way. Uh, even the freaking professors yeah. following you from city to city. I'm like, dude, leave me alone. Like, what the hell? I'm trying to go on an adventure here. I want you holding my hand the whole time. Like, go away. No, you're wrong, me. bro. X and Y was the fucking fox, the fire fox. Greninja. Greninja actually knew. Greninja, Greninja was, was the starter. fire one. Yeah, in sun, in um X and Y. Greninja's not a fire Greninja Pokemon. No, Greninja was the blue one. Del Fox was the fire one. So confused. And Chestnut. Was... Yo, that's my dog's name, bro. Chestnut is my Jeez. dog's name. Bro. Shout out, Chestnut. shout out, dog, bro. Shout out, Andre's doggy, bro. Yeah. Oh, All right. No, I know. Greninja is the best. Weirdly Greninja enough, boys, we played. should probably get to some anime because uh, fuck we your got anime, like bro. Almost yo, an fuck hour anime, in. bro. Let's start talking fuck about your anime, bro. Okay, hold on. Hold I want to know what Sun and Moon was. All right, um, we figure that out on our own time. There's like owls. And oh like yeah, a cat I did and the like owl. A seal. A what seal? was the seal? Mean? <laughs> what did the seal evolve into? It's just a bigger seal. It's like it's like a like a sh- a flamboyant seal becomes. I guess you could say. I don't even remember these. Po- Literally, is what's the the fire one called? The bunny hopper, bunny kicks. No man, that's it. that's the wrestling one. What's the wrestling? The one wrestling called? one. The fire cat wrestler. That's one in, in Super Incineroar. Smash. In, 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 yeah, in, it's that's in, Incineroar. Incineroar. Oh, that's Incineroar. So yeah, what's the yeah. pig? What's the pig in the other one called? Uh, not Infernape. The one after Infernape, and he turns in. And he, he's just like a little pig, and he turns into a. Yeah, pig. yeah. Isn't it, wait? Maybe pig. that's Incineroar. That's what I thought was Incineroar. Then the ape one is the one you're talking about. Infernape. No, the cat. <laughs> There's a cow one. <laughs> I'm so confused right now. I'm so yo. Let's uh let's uh. <laughs> um, no, it is incineroar. It's incineroar, bro. Yeah, I'm not, not solving this, bro. I'm trying to move on, man. I'm trying to get out of here. I'm trying to I'm trying to move on to this to this. Uh, okay, anyway, as they're figuring that out, guys, I I myself am a foot 
football fan. It's Embor, bro. That's what. Because he's a boar. True. Tepig, pig knight, and Embor. Yes. Yes, yo, I don't actually left, bro. <laughs> I actually got up at the same time I remembered I bought something, so I wanted to show you guys. So it kind of worked out in my favor. Can I see it? Wait, can I see it? Is it a quack? Oh, yeah, I'm going to show you. Are you, guys, are you guys caught up with uh, My Hero, by the way? My um, Hero? No. I've seen one. But show me anyways. I don't care. No. Whoa. It's... Little girl. I have no idea who that is. Really? <laughs> oh, shit. Well, this girl's busted as fuck. She's, uh... Oh, no. That's the girl with the horn. Yeah. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. She could turn back time or something, right? What no, she no, do? no. We don't talk about it. Sean, Sean needs to watch it. Um, no, I need to know what she does. I forget what she does. Tell me what she does. She has a horn. Yeah, what else does she need? No, like her horn gets bigger and then because like, you know how friggin' um, the main character like breaks his body. When, 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 his when, Midoriya, yeah. when Midoriya uses yeah, energy. Yeah, Midoriya. Um, he he, you he know, breaks his body, her. but she's, yeah. oh, she can make it so things didn't happen. Yes. Like no, she just she can like she's like the girl Reverse from Bleach thing. where she can yeah. she can turn back Re time but physical Reject. time. Yeah. Not like right. spatial. Not actual like physical. Time. Yeah. Right, right, right. Um but anyway, that's a that's a really cool scene, uh, with her and uh him. Cool. But what I was gonna say was I personally love football slash soccer and Blue Lock released a new trailer. Um I'm excited for it. It's supposed to be released. I yeah, it's missed it. It's just another. It's yeah. just another character that they that they introduced. So it's nothing crazy. Did but you watch um uh, Futsal Boys? Have you, have you watched I it? I, I watched two watched episodes. It. I'm like, it's mm, not good. It's not. It's it's more like <laughs> slice of life than it is futsal. I thought you like slice of life. I do, but peak. You know, peak, you, after you watch peak, you can't really watch. That's true. Uh, That's true. It's a good yeah. point. <laughs> you know, once you see cosplays being made, it's 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 different. Right? It's different. <laughs> Um, but yeah, so Blue Lock looks fantastic. I can't wait. Um, but anyway, yeah, we, you gotta watch it. We gotta get to some anime though. This week, guys, we we're gonna be talking about probably, probably just Attack on Titan. Maybe. <laughs> oh on no! Oh, fucking Boji's cursed, bro. Boji. Boji. Right? However, cursed. this last episode of Boji was fire. The big four. I just want yeah. you to know. I just want Crazy. you to know that fucking iPhone 13s have 90 hertz fucking refresh rates. 120 and actually, like, my friend. Does it? 120. I don't know. Like, I just wipe along I sell this. Those I'm things. like, yo, this is... It's like, <laughs> yo, this is smooth, bro. Why do I even have my phone? What's smooth. the point? Yo, what's the point of the phone I have, bro? Once you go back to your old phone, you'll be like, yeah, my phone's lagging. I can't use this. <laughs> my laptop doesn't even run, run that high. No, no, no. You have it's to have a special screen. Man. It's, it's ridiculous. Yeah, like, shout I'm, out Apple. I'm kind of no. mad they gave this to me. <laughs> this it just makes you want to Don't say it. that, bro. They're going to see the I pod, I hope bro. I get to keep this so much. They're going to see the pod, bro. They're going to take it back. They're going to be like a Samsung Anyways, S9. thank you for listening. Good day, goodbye. I got to go kill a dragon. Bye. Peace. <laughs> Um, say our socials. Putting it right in the middle is a great thing. Okay, so uh, we we do post. Uh, I swear to God, we post weekly. I promise you guys. You sure? uh, follow us on tw no. F follow us on Twitter, Instagram, uh, YouTube. Is we got some shorts on there with also the full length uh, pod. Um, yeah, just hit us up on LinkedIn. Yeah. Be like, yo, I, I got a free space for you guys to record. Um, yeah. If you ever ha you guys have a free space, uh, Fridays is when the audio comes out. Saturdays mm -hmm. is when the video comes out. Um, and this year is going to be a fantastic year going on. You know, we're gonna we're gonna watch a lot of great anime. Yeah. We're gonna see a lot of great anime end. Um, and Lord have mercy, I'm bust. And that's yeah. don't it. worry. And I'm just gonna like put it into, speak into fruition. Weeb news. Weeb news weekly is coming. And we just like Alan said, we have. Mm -hmm. The logo, so it's coming. Just like Alan said, uh, one day every week, 54 weeks a year. That's right, 54 weeks and 375 <laughs> days, 100%. That's what it is. That's what it's all about, man. I'm pretty sure that's the math, too, because that my brain does that. Where it, okay, anyway. So, this week we watched Attack on Titan. Uh, uh, Andre, do I'm the thing. Do a quick, yeah, yeah, do, yeah, do, yeah, do the team, do the team, brother. Okay, so yeah, basically, Attack on Titan, we start team. Aaron still marching. Damn, he left, bro. Wow, that's disrespectful. That's I think. I've never like experienced that. I mean, <laughs> right? That, now you know how it feels. It, it hurts a little bit, mm -hmm. bro. Oh, damn, bro, it hurts a little bit. Um. Anyways, so basically, um, Aaron's still doing the walking. Everyone's considering their things. The um. The walking. Um, Armin, walking. Ar 
Oh, Armin, no. Ar- Armin. Oh, okay. Let's do this. Connie and um, Falco um, decide that they should brush some teeth, and then Armin's like, "Never mind. Let me jump into his mouth because I think I- Sean knew this last week." Because Sean freaking suggested, "What if Armin jumps <laughs> in his mouth?" Oh my goodness! What if he? Did? You guys what never. Yeah, you guys never think I'm telling the truth when I say what's going to happen anyway. So yo, you're always yo, like, yo, "Oh, man. Sean said it, so it's not going to happen." I'm like, oh, try oh, this one on for size. <laughs> Is there a die? So Sean, no. <laughs> what? <laughs> nothing, nothing. Aaron definitely dies, see. bro. I'm on, he has I'm, to, bro. I'm 100% prepared for that. Anyways, so Armin jumps in after they don't brush his teeth, and then um, Connie saves him, and he's like, oh, damn, my mom would be disapprove of this. And everyone's like, duh. And then so they go back to town, and then Annie's there, and Annie's like, oh, shit, I got to eat. I haven't eaten in four years, and then Connie just starts dying. He's like, "Ah, you're stuffing your face, you freaking loser!" She starts dying, and he's like, "What's going on?" And then, listen, the girl that put her life on the line to yeah. protect Annie, mm-hmm. Annie's just like, "Peace." Right. Here's a letter, Peace and then she's just like, "Dog, I bought a whole. You, I literally told you I was gonna go buy a whole pie, <laughs> and now I have a whole pie by myself." And then, anyways, so Annie goes with them. They find Reiner. They kick Reiner in the face, I and know. they're like, "Hey!" And then Sasha's like, "Yo, not Sasha." Sasha. Oh, my God, I can't oh. Oh. Thank you guys for watching. It's been a great <laughs> week. We actually are retiring the pod at our one year anniversary. Um, appreciate it, guys. See you later. Bye. <sighs> yeah, he's crying. Look at him. Gabby. <laughs> Gabby. Oh, it's like, no, of Gabby it's of all Gabby. people. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's why do you think why do you think it hurts so much that I got them confused? That's why. Yeah. Gabby. Gabby's like, hey, listen, Reiner's nev- not gonna wake up for days, and then, so, and then, uh, oh my god, I'm gonna say it again. And Annie's like, now nah, he's gonna wake up right now and they kick him in the face. And then she's like, yo, we gotta go kill Aaron. And then he's like, yo, where are we going? He's like, to save the world. And then, Avengers and then the event. Event. Da, 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 da. That's pretty much that's what weird. happened, right? Okay. I didn't miss anything no, important. wait, wait, you missed something. So Mikasa is like, yo, where the fuck's my scarf? Oh, <laughs> yeah, she's like, I got my scarf. And I'm like, who the fuck is this girl? Bro? Yeah, right? Not, there's so many random blonde people in this show that I have no idea who they no, are. My favorite, my favorite's when like the girl's like, I really admired you and Aaron. And da 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 da. And then uh, Mikasa's like, who? Mikasa's like, give and me then, my scarf. Yeah, right? Mikasa's like, Mikasa's like, Mikasa's like, who? And the girl's like, you know, I watched her and Mikasa literally just goes, <laughs> <laughs> just, he just, she just takes it. The girl's still right? talking, dying. Yeah, She's like, I know. Yeah, yeah Mikasa, I'm dying, right? Yeah, so, like, yeah. I just want you to hear my last words. And Mikasa's was like, "Fuck Give you." My scarf. Just yeah. <laughs> How did she get the friggin' cannon splinter in her stomach? Oh, I don't know. The thunder spear must ricochet. Yeah, like how she got thunder spear in her stomach? Look at Levi. <laughs> look at Levi, man. Probably- oh my god, wait, <laughs> we didn't talk about Levi either. Jesus Christ, Andre. <laughs> oh yeah. <laughs> Um, Levi met up with um, the cannon and um, Pick. Mm. The Pick. Well, and, the like, and they're like, why shouldn't we kill you? And they're like, and uh, Levi's like, I don't know. But um, <laughs> Fuck it. I want to go kill Aaron. So, like, if y'all want to come with, like, we can do that. But you if you don't, Zeke. like, uh, and he's like, oh, like, I want to go kill Zeke. Like, right. we can go do that. But, like, if you don't, then, like, you can shoot me in my face. Like, <laughs> my face is, like, half missing. So, like, it's not like I can help. Or, like, stop you or anything. So, like, we can go ahead and do that. Stickers. I don't know what that is. Stickers. Um, Stickers. This is the first time where Zeke has been completely... I'm not Zeke. Where Levi's been, like, completely useless. Yeah, right? And he's talking pretty big for a guy who's freaking useless. Yeah. And honestly, honestly, so for a freaking <laughs> atomic bomb that blew up in front of his face and touched, like, the stitches, like, line of stitches. Yeah. It's like, That's what, what I said last week, bro. Mm-hmm. It's kind of crazy, you know? But I will say, like, I give more credit to AOT because at least Hanji had to s- stitch his face. Like, yeah. last yeah. week, I literally thought she she just fucking bandaged his face. She's like, oh, good. <laughs> all good. <laughs> and then that was it. Yeah. But at least and his fingers, to too, eh? Is his, like, uh. Oh, yeah, he's missing digits. Yeah, to use the 3D uh, maneuver gear. It's, uh, get you. Oh. It's pretty useless now. Nah, nah, he's gonna go out in the style. He's gonna be, like, just flying into Zeke. Yeah. Yo, he's gonna tell freaking, um, Piet to freaking toss him. Into Zeke, he's gonna hold the freaking swords and then peeks in and throw his freaking board. And he's gonna be <laughs> strapped to the board to fly through the air. And go like, 
Oh my god. That is some oh. image you put in my head. Yeah, I like that. Uh, what right. about what about um that plan that Jean and uh, Mikasa and Pete came up with where the Jaeger Oh yeah, yeah. Forgot about Man, that we forgot too. so much. <laughs> Andre, Andre just fucking sucks. Yo, I don't care, bro. I'm playing Elden Ring right now, bro. <laughs> but like, um fucking doesn't give a shit. <laughs> fucking John's like, yo, I'ma kill you, black man. And he's like, oh shit, it's black history month. Can't do that. So he shot two times to the side, set up freaking thing, and then they saved him, and then Pierre came out of nowhere, cart titan, I'ma eat y'all. And then he she's like, Oh shit, your breath stinks. And PX like, yo, that's rude. And everyone's like, yo, you're a titan. You eat humans. It's not my fault your breast stinks. And she's like, true. And he's like, and then, what's her name? Um, female Armin is like, why'd y'all save me? Yelena. Then, oh, yeah. Yelena. Yeah, yeah, Yelena. Right? Yelena's like, why'd y'all save me? And then they're Armin's like, yo, they wanted you. And then he gave him a sh- her scary look. And she's like, yo, like, listen, like, I've been trying really hard. And one thing went wrong, so I give up. So I don't care what happens. Yeah, right. Like, literally, everything went exactly how she wanted. Mm -hmm. One thing. One thing went wrong. And she's just like, I'm done. Yeah, right? I give up. It's over. Zeke was basically her god. So, like, to know that he's, like, not in it anymore, she's like, oh, well. Bro, Aaron has had 17 different gods since the (laughs) anime started. Everything Aaron has believed in has gone wrong, and Aaron's just like, nah, I gotta try this. He's like, oh, that's not working, I gotta try this. Every person Levi cared about is dead. Mm, Every person yeah. Armin cared about has betrayed him or is dead. Except, and except, all these, except Annie, brother. Except Annie, that's true. For now. But I'm just saying, actually, no, Annie betrayed him, so... No, no, chill. Yo, you guys think Connie laughed at Annie because, like, she looked like Sasha when Sasha ate food? Oh. I honestly think Connie, it was, like, the... It was kind of just, like, so much shit has been happening. Exactly. And then he just looked over and he's Uh, just like... Oh, also He's just like, Annie? He's just like, really? He's (laughs) like, all this shit's going on. (laughs) And now Annie's just there. Really? And she's just, like, stuffing her face. Like, nothing happened. Like, she's just eating a pie. This is so normal. What is happening right now? And he kind of just, like, freaking lost his mind. He almost fed a child to his mom. I know. Uh, But, you know, kudos, kudos, (laughs) kudos to Connie for being the only, like... I said that last week, and Sean yeah. tried to throw me off the set. I no, saw no, him. I, I. He's I, like, oh really? Is he? He's like, oh really? Is he regretting his decision? Is he questioning himself? Shut your, shut your, <laughs> shut your bitch ass up. Okay. No, shout out to like, shout out to Connie or uh, Isayama for writing Connie mm-hmm. as like a normal person. Like, oh yeah, he's like yeah. A, he's not a hero. Yeah. He doesn't want to be. He just wants things for himself. And I feel like yeah. most humans want that. If that was my mom, <laughs> brother, I would have threw. I would have threw both. <laughs> I, my mom would have been the jaw titan and the colossal titan at the same time. Yeah. To be honest with you, um, but, but to but, be honest, like at this point, like even especially in the manga, when I read this chapter, I just like finished it and looked up and I was like, "What the fuck is going on anymore?" Like, what the hell? <laughs> like you have freaking Connie who's going. He, they have to make a whole chapter about Connie trying to feed this kid to his mom, and then suddenly at the end he's like, "Oh, let's go save the world," and you're just like, "The fuck is it? like what?" <laughs> Everyone's just like, oh, Connie's like the head of, he's leading the team now. <laughs> like, what? Yeah, yeah he's got his one this chance is, to shine, This man. is what I meant. I'm telling you, the second, at the end of that episode, when Aaron said, I'm going to destroy the mm-hmm. world, I'm like, this anime is either going to be the best thing on earth, or it's going to go to complete shit. <laughs> and there's, there's only two ways it can yeah, go. True. And I'm telling you right now. Currently, it is going to shit. (laughs) It's going to shit. Because no way, no way on earth, all these people are like, oh, you murdered my family. Mm -hmm. You killed all these people. But hey, we got to kill Aaron. So, eh, come come join us. Let's go. Oh, Annie, you're eating a pie. Hey, come join us. Like, like the character switching. Yeah. Like, one of the biggest issues with uh, Game of Thrones was, like, friggin', um... The brother and sister, you know, the freaking mm-hmm. brother literally spent his, like a season and a half growing. Yeah. He's like, maybe I don't need my sister. Mm-hmm. And then in the moment of truth, he's just like, never mind. Fuck all that character growth. I'm going to go back to my sister and get crushed by rubble. Yeah. Uh, spoiler, alert. spoiler alert. Anyway, so he knows. <laughs> <laughs> spoiler alert for all anime we, we talk about in this. Uh, well, technically, and, and he didn't say who it was. Live action. Yeah. Yeah. Anyway. It was Jamie. Yeah. <laughs> she- <laughs> anyways yeah so like it was literally like that kind of moment where just like all this character growth all this hate i built up hate mm-hmm. for me maybe for them it's been four years for me it's been like fucking 12 years bro 
Yeah, it's okay. been longer. You're still not over it. You're still not even close. <laughs> exactly. Like, all this shit's been happening, and then they've built up this resentment for this long, and then all of a sudden they're like, oh, but we gotta go kill Aaron, so, I mean, I guess you can work together. They never said kill Aaron. They said stop Aaron. <laughs> Maybe. What else are you gonna do? They're gonna kill him, bro. They're gonna freaking put it in front of Aaron, and they're gonna be like, listen, man. Like, we appreciate what you're doing for us, but, like, let's not murder everyone. Aaron's just going to be like, you know what? You're right. All right. Let's, let's stop that's this. It. I did the rumbling. That's, that's what happens. That's how, that's how it goes. And then, nah, he, then he sends the Titans back, and then they remake the walls, and then they live happily. No, 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 no. That's, that's what we, that's what, yeah. like, that's what mm-hmm. regular animes would do, right? Yeah. That's, and what, then, that's what, but you know what the problem with this is? Shut up, Sean, you bitch, for a second, all right? Fuck me, man. Let me talk. <laughs> What's going to happen? Is that mm-hmm. Isayama's already planned it out where he's like, you know what? I he's w- definitely watched Code Geass, and I'm getting the vibes already. And he's like, yeah, let's let's stick, let's go together, let's let's do this. And Reiner's like, yeah, let's let's do this. Thing. I've seen this before. Aaron will fucking die. He's gonna die, and it's gonna be Amen. it's gonna be the one of the. That's, there's only the two people that will kill for him. Me, I still haven't seen yet, so. What? Oh, shit, okay. Really? The, well, for me, there's only two people that'll make this fine, and I'm getting heavy vibes on one of them. But obviously, Armin, he was mm-hmm. foreshadowed to be the savior of humanity. Okay. But mm-hmm. Mikasa with her black Air Force ones going up to that dying girl with a cannonball in her stomach, saying, "Give me my fucking scarf back, bitch." That's that's who I'm rooting on. She needs uh, she needs to do something significant if she wants to hey be man, top. Hey man, she made top a decision finally, bro. Finally, she finally de- made a decision. She's like, "Give me my scarf but, back, bro." Okay, that was okay, hold for on. Me. You know what's crazy about this decision that she made? It's it's so hypocritical because not really, but she didn't really say anything that's hypocritical. But the girl loved Mikasa, loves our. It looked uh, like she Aaron. was jealous, bro. That's like I, Mikasa was jealous. Like she was having this whole heart to heart, and then she's like, "Aaron told me his plan," and she's like, "Give me my fucking scarf back. Yeah, right? Die. No, <laughs> oh Go shit. die." Uh, no, no, no. What I'm saying is that you, you, Mikasa, I feel like is a little upset. Not be at the uh, well at the girl because mm-hmm. think about this. Uh, now Mikasa has been told like everything she's did is because of the influence of someone. And like she had no mind for herself. Well, take this little girl for example, right? Or girl, not little. She is literally dying because she and like she was so like I don't know what's the word. Admir- she admired Mikasa so much for saving her, and she wanted to do good as well. So she literally followed the path of this one person that she couldn't get her mind off of. And Mikasa has seen that. So if you if you put that into into like Mikasa's perspective, Aaron is the person that she literally followed blindly into this thing that maybe she doesn't want to do but she doesn't care because Aaron's there I feel like there is some sort of like ah I hate you because you you, you, you did this to yourself to follow me but she's also in her maybe in her head like I'm like this to Aaron maybe I need some hmm. scarf taking away maybe someone needs to take Mikasa's hmm. scarf away and maybe Armin's gonna take Mikasa's scarf away and when I say scarf I mean um, Aaron uh, uh, Virginia, Armin's- I mean what <laughs> you know what? It's been it's been a great pod. It's been a great year. We tried our best, but we cannot mature up, bro. It's been a good we're run, out boys. Here, we're out here talking about Armin losing. You know, it is what it is, man. What? It is what it is. I said I'm saying it is what it is. Okay. All I'm saying is I like. I'm trying to look for foreshadowing because that's what Isayama does mm-hmm. best. But all I can fucking get is that Levi has three fingers on one hand. That's all I got in this episode. And maybe the scarf analogy that I said. How is he going to do fr- uh, and fr- frisbee spin if he doesn't have his fingers? He's going to use his toe. Tanjiro, Tanjiro did it just fine, bro. Tanjiro did it just that's fine. That's true. That's true. Yeah. Actually. He said, shut your heart ablaze. And then that's what Levi's going to say. And then boom. Yeah. He d- Levi just got to be flashy and he's got it. Don't worry. Yeah. No issues. Yeah. <laughs> no issues at all. I don't know. This episode was pretty cool. I think next episode yeah. we're about to get some. We're about to get some shit. Like we're gonna about to get some. What the frig is going on? Bullshit. Also, um, did it I hope- feel weird for you guys when like um, when Connie and Falco were talking? Like, did you notice anything weird? <laughs> with the freaking looks you're talking about? No, with the voices. Mm-hmm. Well, actually, the, well, the looks seems to be just the running theme. And he's like, this, he's, he's like, he's like, he's like, why are you bringing me to a tent? He's like. Drum. 
I'm gonna brush his teeth. <laughs> yeah, and right. Falco's just like, okay. yeah, <laughs> yeah. Falco yeah. is way too trusting. But yeah, did you notice anything about the voices? I know Andre no. wouldn't because he's terrible at recognizing Japanese actors' voices. Oh, are they the same voices or what? It's Zenitsu and Tanjiro. Tanjiro. Connie is Zenitsu and oh, uh, Falco is Tanjiro. Not because oh. I'm bad at recognizing Japanese. It's just like not a thing I'm like looking for. <laughs> I can't <If> read. I... <laughs> what? <laughs> this guy I don't, do with I don't know, man. This guy... You're a legend, bro. You're I know, bro. Good. I'm going to go my whole life without being able to read. This is going to be crazy. <laughs> Fucking crazy, bro. Um... But I mean, that's yeah. I think next. Uh, hey, Sean, be honest with me. Is next episode gonna be bussin or not? Did he freeze really after you asked that question? Nah, I see his fucking smirk. <laughs> 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 what was the question? <laughs> no. I can't answer. Andre might get shot. Okay, okay, Alan, Alan, Alan. I need Alan, Andre's permission. What do you think their plan was? I need Andre's permission to answer that. What question. do you think their plan uh, is going to uh, be? Andre, can you answer? Can you just Alan, tell what me? What do you yes? think their plan is going to be? Bro, they're just going to go see if Aaron's fucking dumb or if he's like. Are they going to try to talk to him and then it's not going to work? No, nah, it's not going to be talked right? to. They're going to be like, yo, let's the uh, Aaron. Aaron, please, Aaron. And then Aaron's going to be like, nah. Uh, hey, Sean, I saw your face. I'm right. What? They're gonna talk to him. It's not gonna work, and then they're gonna chop his head no, off. No, I was thinking about something else. I was thinking no, about the fact that you still can't stop figure talking out about the, him dying. The Falco thing that we were talking about before. I was thinking, remembering that you guys still couldn't get that. <laughs> what Falco thing? Never his mind. Voice? Just no, voice no. Thing? From a previous episode, I said something about Falco. Oh shit! You said something and, about Falco, and then we were guessing. Yeah, <laughs> you were couldn't get it, right? <laughs> it still hasn't happened uh, yet. No, no, no. He's gonna eat Aaron. Is that it? Uh, you're not gonna get. It. <laughs> you won't even remember the point that it was like, that was funny. I would have to. I'll have to tell you after you, you see. Cause it's just... he's gonna eat Mikasa just like, <laughs> and then become an Ackerman Titan, and then Holy he's gonna fuck. get giant. He's gonna be, get giant EODM gear, yeah, and yeah. then he's gonna be a Titan just flicking <laughs> plane. <laughs> Yo, imagine, imagine he eats Mikasa and just becomes a fucking Titan Gundam. Imagine Titan Levi, bro, that can Beyblade as a Titan, bro. That's He'll still be funny. four feet tall, but he'd be a nasty Titan. <laughs> Right? That would be nah, ridiculous. He'd be at least 6'7, bro, as a Titan, bro. Yeah, Don't yeah. Steve, yeah, the average basketball player could fucking <laughs> kill him. Like, what the fuck? Um, yeah, what, what if, what if Falco did eat, like, a like an Ackerman and just became, like, a Gundam? Like, a, a fleshy Gundam? <laughs> you know what I mean? Yeah. Well, they all, they all look kind of like that. Hey, 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 Sean, is it Falco? You're never going to get it. Has sex with Tabby. Oh my god. And then Lord, they pass on dude. the Titan. They pass on the founded Titan. Dude. Even though they're fucking children. We're gonna get flagged. Okay, very Eventually. This episode. Michelle Potensei did it. They still existed, didn't they? They're kids. Michelle Potensei did it. And That's they true. still they on air. It. We're fucking fired, bro. <laughs> I'm gonna contact your work. I'm gonna 52 be like, this is you hired, bro. <laughs> Yo, actually, I, like I episode. said, bro, anyway. guys, if you don't see if you don't see us next week, it's because we're fucking dead, and like the <laughs> FBI took Andre away. They they finally <laughs> found my stash of whatever I got behind here, and obviously, look at Sean, tax evasion, brother. Yeah. It's written all over him. Alan's so got he's some gone too. Back there, he's like, I got some. Oh, I got some <laughs> sensu. Uh, what? No. Yo, man. what's just gonna happen? Yo, if, if, yo, if Sean gets audited this year, <laughs> just, remember, just remember what you said, Alden. Just I got you, bro. He's getting um, tax evasion, bro. Yeah, his parents are his parents are moving for what, bro? Trying to get away from the taxes. This is what yeah, it that's is. What, that's caught up dad. to them. My dad drives a Lincoln Navigator, and that's where he got the yeah. money from. Where, where, is, where are your parents from? Ireland? Yeah. Said, Who the fuck is that guy? Let's get out of here. That's what? A, no, that was weird. That's, that's a terrible accident. started accent. okay, so but it got moment. worse. Yeah, yeah. The end, yeah. Who, the fuck, who the fuck is that guy? Now that's, I need to, okay, that's I need, a different accent. Who the what fuck are you is, doing, what, I laddie? My, <laughs> that's a stack in the Scottish. That's Scottish. What are you doing, <laughs> laddie? <laughs> Oh my god! We got like child <laughs> stuff. Alan started like, saying Irish. Racism. I can't do Irish. Alden went and said, "Freaking Indian." Whoa, I can do bro. I can do British and I can do Scottish. I can do Irish. I can Irish. do some Irish. sort of whatever. Irish. Alan does okay. some Irish Indian mix. This is this is terrible. We need to end this. All right, guys, guys, we can hit two hours, bro, and just do Boji, bro. 
Uh, I'm not. Can't. No, I can't. I can't. I'm I can't hungry. I'm tired. I yeah. Can't. There's <laughs> no way. Thank no, you guys for watching. It's, it's been phenomenal. Out. Andre been speaking some crazy shit this episode. I'm so sorry if you don't like it. But uh, it is what it is. Grow up. Guys, sub to us. Give us a like. We had one anime and we still didn't talk about. I know. Bullshit. We had two. Anime. It don't matter. It don't matter. No, we did. Yeah, yeah, attack. Blue lock. Blue lock. Blue lock. Yeah, attack. That was it. Attack was the only one. Oh yeah. Doesn't matter. Anyways. We didn't break down Blue Lock. The, you just said that. You just said the trailer. Was Andre, great. I'm, shut up! What's the point of saying all this? We're done. I'm freaking astonished that I said we weren't going to talk about Boji. I still know you did as a joke. You jinxed us. And we actually didn't. We Andre's actually. fault. Low key. All right, guys. Oh my god! And that's mostly because of you. Stuff. You talked about Elden Ring for like two hours. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> Sorry, Alan. You can go. I need I'm to so take a upset. big Osmo shit. Oh, no, no, you, you can, you can, you can go ahead and finish this one off. I'm good. Uh, no, you. What did he say? Alan, this is your job. You, you, you can, can, I don't you know can watch what Alan our. Says, bro. You can. Alan has to do. <laughs> you can watch our Instagram and our Facebook, and you can watch Alan's t- Twitch streams at alan.twitch.stream.ca. And <laughs> <laughs> that's it. That's it right there. <laughs> you can sub to Andre's amazing AMVs at Andre Campbell. Uh, AMV, <laughs> master.net. <laughs> I'm losing my mind, man. And uh, what's the name the of our podcast? Out Friday, Saturday, <laughs> yeah, Saturdays, our video comes out on YouTube. Uh, we appreciate all the support you guys have given us over the past year. It's been a great uh, journey, and we can't wait to provide you with more stupidness because that's all this is. It's just stupid. <laughs> We are grown men talking about cartoons uh, and can't keep a straight face for an hour and a half. This is just what it is, man. This is just I'll what it is. It's not my fault for getting across a lot of virginity, bro. She tried her best, bro. What the fuck is... <laughs> she did what the best is, she could. I'm, I'm leaving, bro. All right. Thank you guys for watching. I'm out, bro. I, I, can't, I can't be a part of this <laughs> Yo, now. You, we're going to get Jujutsu Kaisen tickets, guys, and we'll talk about yeah. it when it releases in North America. Yep. Not this week, but the week after, I think. I think tickets already went on sale, so it might be sold out. But uh, I pulled a shot oh, like- and I bought tickets for me and my girlfriend already. <laughs> but I can watch. All right, so me and Sean are going to go watch there Jujutsu you Kaisen. Go. I won't be part of that podcast. So Alan wow. can do whatever the fuck me. he wants. I'll let you guys know about the concert on. next week and how it went. Nice. It's, it's, see, yes. it's only Andre. It's only Andre that really doesn't have anything to do. No, no, no. <laughs> see, like, like, see, the difference is... Like me, like Sean and the concert, I admit fault consistently. I just forgot. True. But um, that whole Jujutsu Kaisen tickets, like literally, if like we said, we're gonna watch it together, and then yeah, Alan yeah. decided to do his own thing. <laughs> I did. I see. Like so, I didn't say I wasn't gonna watch it with you guys. Uh, but you just assumed that I said that now, and now I feel okay, very upset. You're, you're watching it by yourself, so you do you. Me and Alan. I'm not watching it by <laughs> myself. We can watch it together. God. Now me and Sean will watch it. Um, Alan do whatever he wants. It's fine. Um, God. We're not gonna be a podcast. Look how petty this we're gonna guy get is, tickets. Look we're gonna get. We're gonna get tickets crying. to Anime North. Uh, but Alan's gonna go on his by himself on Friday, and that's then right, me that's and right. Sean will go on Sunday. And the so best part, and the best part about being me is I'm the life of the party. So <laughs> you can't be the life if we've never seen you alive. So <laughs> Sheesh, yo, that's a quote. I'm gonna get that shit tattooed on my fucking ass. <laughs> <laughs> Whatever. Uh, anyway, so Alan, Alan and his girl are gonna watch Jujutsu Kaisen when it comes out. Um, right. Sean, Sean and I will go right. watch it when it comes out. So that's right. Um, Whenever that is, when does it come out? It comes out next week. I think. No, yeah. not next week. The week after next. Um, <laughs> <Don't care. laughs> Have so yeah, a great day. That's it for the pod. It's been great um, potting with you guys. Um, Holy fuck! These guys can't do an outro to save their life. <laughs> I don't know what to do, bro. How do you end it? I, you do it. I don't right, fucking do it. See you guys next year. Appreciate it. Yeah, see you guys next year. Uh, tw- two weeks. Bye. Bye.